And donations pouring in tonight for a Jackson County Sheriff's deputy who was recently admitted to the hospital with a life-threatening medical condition. In just the past three days, a GoFundMe account has raised more than $14,000 to help deputy Noah Strawmeyer and his family pay for medical bills. NBC 5's Cassie Nelson joins us live in studio with the latest. Cassie? Deputy Strawmeyer is a 10-year veteran of the Sheriff's Office. Family, fr family friend Patricia Landfair says the 34-year-old is an amazing father to three young kids, a devoted husband, and a highly respected public servant. Strawmeyer was hospitalized last week for what they thought was pneumonia, but it turns out he had congestive heart failure. He was put in a medically induced coma, but Landfair says his condition is improving. He has been taken off of life support and he's breathing on his own. So it's small steps in the right direction. Um, he's not out of the woods yet. It's going to be a while. Landfair created a GoFundMe page to help with the family's medical bills and money has poured in from all over the nation. In just three days, the page has been shared 1,300 times and raised more than $14,000. If you would like to donate, we'll show you how on our website, KOBI5.com. Landfair is also gathering gift, gift cards for the family. Whether it be for groceries or meals out, those can be left at the Sheriff's Office on Crater Lake Highway. Get well cards for Deputy Strawmeyer can also be dropped off there. Live in the studio, Cassie Nelson, NBC5 News.